Hey, how's it going everyone? My name is Mick Ambrose. You're watching All About Tech. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Um, today's video, it's, it, it's, it's a couple different topics I'm going to cover again today. And the first one I'm going to get out of the way with, and it's, um, it's some positive nudes. N nudes? <laughs> nudes. <laughs> some positive news. <laughs> Not nudes. That, don't do that. Um, some positive news in regarding to Electronium, and that is that Electronium won the community vote on Twitter to be integrated onto Sato Wallet. So if I pull up the um, the the screen here, here's the post. We gained forty three percent. Be Electra, Bit White, and Jesus Coin. <laughs> Jesus Coin. That's funny. Um. And every, every, a lot of you will be thinking, well, what is this? Like, it doesn't sound very big. And no, they're not. They're not. They're not the biggest. They're not the biggest exchange in the world, etc. But um, they are. They are, they are quite ambitious. And if we look at Electronium as what we want to achieve, we want to achieve that mass adoption by making it as easy as possible to get introduced to cryptocurrency. This wallet certainly helps to achieve that. And at the moment, just any any new listings is good news. Then they let's face it, it won't they won't integrate until after um after the fork, because let's face it, it would be stupid if they did. Um and just to just to clarify what what um say to what it is, they are a um they're a mobile wallet and an exchange which can be downloaded on the App Store, the Apple App Store, and the Google Play Store. And the fact that you can get them on both is why I'm going to go into the next topic, which I'm going to talk about Electronium's iOS app. Um, so, but bear with, because I'm going to get into that. So, Seto Wallet, what are they? So... Like I said, they're a mobile, they're a mobile wallet and an exchange, um, and it's very seamless to use. I d I've downloaded it and I've signed up. It it seems quite it it looks. Re I've not like made any transactions or I haven't deposited any electronic. Well, I can't because they haven't integrated yet. I haven't like used any of the functionality yet, but I've signed up and 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 navigated the the um the the screens and stuff and the windows and it's a very nice nice wallet to use i mean you have good um security so you've got um google two two factor authentication personal pin code email verification um all the good stuff you need in 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 good apps these days in terms of security because there's a lot of there's a lot of um malware and a lot of hacks happening um so far they've integrated over 50 cryptocurrencies and it's like i said like they've the community voted and electronium won that community vote which is absolutely fantastic it just shows our community and it just shows that there is demand out there for the use of electronium and what's good about this this mobile wallet and exchange is that you can do an auto coin swap and it will give you the automatic um the automatic like exchange rate if you will um that sort of thing there's no transaction fees which is fantastic you can do airdrops so you can airdrop some coins to um like airdrop payments or receive airdrops to court from coins directly into your wallet app which is good and then this is another good good um feature is that it's it you can trade cryptos as well and what's really good about this is that there's not really mobile wallets i mean there's exchanges i mean like yeah you've got like kucoin binance all, all these things but they're mainly exchanges yeah they have wallet features but they don't emphasize on the whole wallet um functionality whereas sato wallet do and I think that's important. Um, a few testimonials from from some of the other altcoins that are that have that are used um, on on Sato Wallet, and 
This looks very familiar. This little... These moving... Oh, wait, hang on a minute. I'm just going to... um. Hang on a minute. Let's let this load. Wow, my internet's slow today. Oh, here we go. What, what, what the fuck's all this in the background? Ah. Yeah, I mean, they've dimmed down the colours a little bit, but... Oh. oh, it's very similar, isn't it? Yeah. So, yeah, we've seen, we've, we've seen this before. <laughs> so, um, let me get rid of that. Because uh, I don't support it, but um, but yeah, that's that that's Sato Wallet. It's it's good news for the Electronium community. There's still look, there's things, there's always bumps in the road in terms of a new project that's going for such an ambitious goal, and that is mass adoption. And this is just completely unrelated now. And there's 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 been people that have been commenting and um. And just making statements that Electronium's dead, they're a shit coin, blah blah blah. Well, Ripple if if that's if that's how you're how you're how you're saying it, Ripple was a shit coin for two years before they really made some groundbreaking results. Bitcoin was a shit coin for years before it made some groundbreaking results. Monero was a shit coin for like three years before they manage their groundbreaking results and they all mooned. So I think I think I think what I'm trying to say is be patient and give the team time to work on what they're trying to achieve. Let give them the chance to to to, to achieve it before you start making judgments and stuff because your impatience is not anyone else's problem but your own. And in it, when it comes to investing anyway, you don't invest in a stock and expect it to return you <clears throat> these huge gains within a couple months. It just doesn't happen. And I don't know why cryptocurrency is becoming that market where it's expected to happen. Just be just, just because there's a bull run doesn't mean that all the altcoins are going to follow with these huge rises. I mean, yeah, they will, they will have some, some sort of rise. But if you have a coin like Electronium that has a huge sale war at the moment because of ASICs, like no one's taking this into account. That ASIC miners are building this huge sell wall to prevent the price from going from going any higher. And that, and it's obvious to see. And there's a lot of people in denial to see that and they just call it out as a shit coin, blah 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 blah. I mean I've had people say that I've been in denial about it. But if you know anything about business and you know anything about investing, it's the fact that you it you, you have to play the long game. Especially with such ambitions like Electronium's ambitions. But that's me ranting on a bit now. The second thing I want to talk about is this. It's... Well, there's not really... It doesn't really say anything there. There we, there we go. There's the title. This is the news. I mean, it, 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 happened, it happened a few weeks ago now. But Apple announced that they'll be using Ripple's blockchain infrastructure for their Apple Pay system. And when you think about that, you just can't help but think, is this, is this why Electronium's app hasn't been approved yet? And to, 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 to boil it down in a nutshell, it's, it, it's not something that, unless they come out and state that they're not listing anything else because of that, then it's not the case. I don't think it's the case. One, I mean, if, if something like Sato Wallet can hit the, um, the app store then there's no reason why electronium can't i think this this big update that's coming and the um because th th this isn't just a blockchain update as well they announced ages ago that they that they're doing some really good interface updates for the actual app as well to make it more like a paypal like system and make it easier to use um for everyday use and i think at the moment i think what's what what's preventing Electronium from being listed on on the App Store is this mobile miner because it is rewarding people real cryptocurrency for the sake of having their app open and accessing the internet twenty four seven, and I personally believe that Electronium held that poll 
as a way to see what they can do to try and alleviate the issues to get um, listed on the Apple App Store. I don't, I don't see why. I personally don't see why they would be really, really anal to the point where they wouldn't um, list Electronia because of that. I mean, just because the mobile miner is giving people a free cryptocurrency, that they would, I don't know why they wouldn't just, 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 just still accept them onto it. But I, I, I personally believe Apple are trying to work out what they can benefit from it. As any as any business would, how will they how will they benefit from it? Because at the end of the day, there's no ads on the app. There's there's the the, the app's free, so it might just be a case of Apple having to negotiate with Electronium as the, as as the terms of how much Electronium are willing to pay to get that app listed on the App Store because they. The app doesn't offer any beneficial things to 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 Apple. I mean, yeah, they'll get a lot of traffic and loads of people will download the app, but that doesn't generate them any revenue because the app's free. So I think it's about it. I think that is more the case of how Apple are going to benefit from their app. And at the moment, it's hard to see where they'll benefit from that app. But it's it's a question I'd love to see answered. If anybody has any idea why, what what they could do to um to benefit to benefit them let me know um and it's something i could make a future video on but um apart from that that's all i want to talk about if you like this video oh oh yeah i forgot i forgot to mention i've i've changed back to the original studio i've moved again and i forgot to change the writing back to um a different color but thank you for watching this video if you liked it, give it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Um, at the moment, there's not really a lot of a lot of there's not really going to be a lot of news regarding Electronium that 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 needs to be um, announced via YouTube and things like that. So I'm probably going to use the time to create some more videos in regards to um, some different cryptocurrencies, etc. Maybe try and get a few tech videos out that I've been meaning to try and do, and. And basically use the time until the May the 30th. Hold my word to it. May the 30th, if all goes well and that cell will disappears from the ASICs, Electronium's true value will start to represent and start to show, I think. Um, and then along with the partnership deals that are coming, it's things are looking very positive. And the fact that the community is still getting behind Electronium by getting them um, for winning the community... Uh, poll for Sato Wallet, which is great. It really shows how strong this community is. So, um, yeah, like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'll catch you guys out in the next video. Peace out, guys. Have a good evening.